In this video, we are going to discuss the gross anatomy of the pancreas. The pancreas is a glandular organ. Its length is about 12 to 15 centimeters and it weighs approximately 80 grams. Localization. Uh, the pancreas is localized in the abdominal cavity between the duodenal curvature and the splenic hilum. It is located caudal to the omental bursa. Uh, and skeletotopy is found at the level of L1 and L2. The pancreas is a secondary retroperitoneal organ. Right. This means it is not covered by visceral peritoneum and is not attached to the mesentery. The pancreas has two main functions, endocrine and exocrine. Endocrine function. This organ produces hormones like somatostatin, glucagon, and insulin. Exocrine functions. This organ produces digestive enzymes that aid in absorption of macronutrients. It also produces bicarbonates which neutralize the chyme. Anatomical divisions of the pancreas. So the pancreas has the head, neck, body, and the tail. Starting with the head. The head of the pancreas is located within the C-shaped duodenal curvature. The head of the pancreas contains the pancreatic duct and the distal common bile duct. It is an uncinate process, right? So the uncinate process is just an extension of the pancreatic head that is located posterior to the superior mesenteric vessels that is the remainder of the pancreas is not the pancreas also has a neck the neck lies anterior to the portal vein the body the body lies anterior to the aorta and extends to the left kidney the tail the tail lies in the splenorenal ligament and extends to the splenic hilum. The distal segment is intraperitoneal. Right, so this tip of the uh, tail is intraperitoneal. The ducts of the pancreas. The pancreatic duct extends from the tail to the head of the pancreas. It joins the common bile duct and together uh, they form the hepatopancreatic ampulla, also known as the ampulla of Veta. This ampulla of Veta empties into the major duodenal papilla. Right? It's located somewhere here. The hepatopancreatic sphincter or the sphincter of Odi controls the secretion of bio and pancreatic fluid into the duodenum. The accessory pancreatic duct this one is also known as the duct of Santorini. It begins in the head and it drains the pancreatic head and the body. This duct empties at the minor duodenal papilla. Let's have a closer look at the pancreatic ducts. If you look here, you see the pancreatic duct, the main one, and above here there is an accessory pancreatic duct. Right, so this is a, a, a zoomed view. Right, so this is the main pancreatic duct. This is the accessory pancreatic duct. Right, so let's start with the accessory. Let's follow it. It's emptying on the minor duodenal papilla here. Uh, looking at the major pancreatic uh, duct, it combines with the bile duct here to form the hepatopancreatic duct. Right, but it's more, it's more like a sphincter here. It's called the hepatopancreatic sphincter or the sphincter of Odi and it opens um, on the major duodenal papilla, right? Which part of duodenum is this? That's the uh, descending part, the descending part of the duodenum. Vasculature, lymphatics and innervation of the pancreas. The head and neck are supplied by uh, the anterior and the posterior superior pancreatic or duodenal branches us from the gastroduodenal artery and the inferior pancreatic duodenal branches that's from the superior mesenteric artery the body and tail 
are actually supplied by the branches of the splenic artery right so is the a splenic artery is a branch of the celiac trunk the veins the head and neck are drained by the pancreatic veins which will drain into the superior mesenteric vein and to the portal vein the body and tail are drained by the pancreatic veins which will drain into the splenic vein and the portal vein lymphatics uh, they are celiac lymph nodes superior mesenteric and splenic lymph nodes which will drain into the paraiotic lymph nodes the pancreas is innervated uh, like mainly like from the celiac ganglia and there you find sympathetic and parasympathetic fibers sympathetic fibers are from t6 to t12 and parasympathetic are from the vagus nerve that concludes our video on the gross anatomy of the pancreas